The next algorithm which we will be dealing with is called as the scan algorithm. Also known as the elevator algorithm because in this when head is moving in one direction all the requests in that direction are first taken care of. That means if head is moving from point X to point 0 then all communication or rather all requests between X to 0 are first taken over. Followed by if moving from X to Y then all the requests between X and Y are addressed. In most of these cases it would start from a particular location reach to the 0 and from 0 will come down to the other side or in some cases it can start from the X go to the nth last part and again start to the first location. It depends where head is moving. So in scan current example we have head at 53 moving towards 37. So we will be addressing first 37 followed by the 14th. Now understand one thing we are not going to stop but we would reach to the boundary that is 0. After that we will go in the reverse direction. So next in series is third fourth that is 65 67 fifth 98 sixth 122 seventh 124 and finally eighth at 183 a variation to this is a circular scan as we have seen in scan it went till one and then took the other side in circular scan instead of going to zero and then going in the next direction it simply rotates why this is workable or how this is working we should remember that the disk which we are dealing with is circular in nature consider this is the start point as we go further it will again come back to the end and from end will come back to the start we are using the same principle in this as in this case head is at 53 and moving towards 65 so I started with 65 67 98 122 124 183 now the seventh run or rather I'll put it blank if we understand 183 was the highest request which ever made still it will go to the boundary that is 199 and from there it will come reverse but this time reverse is rotation consider this consider over here this is 0 and this is 199 so after 199 I'll again come back to 0 and that's exactly what has happened after 199 this has moved again back to again back to 0 and from 0 it would move ahead to the target now from the 0 side going towards 200 again in terms of rotation we have 7th that is 14 8th that is 37 so this is a C scan one major drawback of c-scan system is even if requests are not at the extreme end read write head is going through the entire rotation a change to c-scan has been made called as c-look in c-look or a circular look we only modify c-scan in one manner instead of going to the end of the disk and then coming back it will only go to the extreme side where the last request is seen and then come back for instance Consider the same scenario as we considered for as we consider for scan where the last request on the left hand side last request on the right hand side was 14 and last request on the other side was 183 even in this case it went to 0 and then again came back but in C look if we are at 53 but in C look if we are at 53 we will have first first 65 then 67 <coughs> third first 65 second 67 third 98 fourth 122 fifth 124 sixth 183 seventh 14 8 37 so basically we are talking about moving through n number but this time rather than going to extreme boundaries that is 0 and 199 we are stopping at extreme request that is 14 
and 183 so that's it thanks for watching this video